In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a name boundary by any shape that you would like to create some earthwork quantities. So in this case, I have a berm that's been modeled. First thing I want to make sure is that I need to create my cut and fill volumes. Let that process. Once I have my cut fill volumes, now let's say I have some staging or something and I only want to process or get quantities for half of this grading. What you can do is go into your drawing ribbon here and just place a microstation shape. Let's just say it looks like this. I'm going to go to my drawing production, name boundaries, and I'm going to place a name boundary by civil element. Here I'm just going to give it a name. It's called stage one. Now on the bottom, on the left, bottom left here is saying identify path element. Now the path element is going to be geometry and I, I don't have any geometry. I want to create a path element that I'm going to use. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit reset here or right click. And now it says select the element. So I'm just going to select this element here. And I'll accept that. Once I have that created, now I can go back to civil analysis and I can create quantities by my name boundary. And you can see in my name boundary group is the stage one that I created. I'll just accept this. But now you can see I can get some quantities by just placing any microstation shape.